Welcome back to Celebrity Corner. I'm Dorothy Castleseri. So who's ready to play a game? <laughs> Get ready for Guess That Star. Tonight we are joined by my dear friend Alyssa Gave, whose book Two Good Round Superstars features interviews with some of the biggest names in TV and sports. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We are also joined by two brave audience members tonight, Ashley from Doylestown, Pennsylvania, and Rose from Horsham, Pennsylvania. Welcome, ladies. Thank you. Look at all these gorgeous ladies up here. I love it. So you uh, wrote this book, it's your second one. You interviewed a lot of famous men in this book. I did, 54 of you, the world's greatest athletes. You have a hard job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fun, it can be very fun. Exactly, now one of the questions that you asked all the guys is, you know, what's their drink of choice on the 19th hole? My dad golfs, my husband golfs, I don't know anything about golf, so I asked what is the 19th hole and what is it? The 19th, well, every golf course has 18 holes, and the 19th hole is always referred to as the bar. So that's, that's where, where you would find snoring. me if I was on the golf course. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll meet you at the 19th hole. And it's where the best stories are. Where the best stories are. So you interviewed four really famous men in sports and television, really, uh, and you asked them what their drink of choice is. So you interviewed uh, Olympic swimmer Michael Phelps. Yes. Sexy. Uh, you, interviewed, uh, you interviewed Michael Strahan, who hosts live with Kelly and Michael. He's doing an amazing He's job. He's doing an incredible job. I want to talk to you about that. Uh, you also interviewed Andy Roddick, who's married to Brooklyn Decker. He's a famous tennis player. And the last one you interviewed is Bruce Jenner, yeah. who, who we all know from Keeping Up with the Kardashians, right? Exactly. Is he the patriarch of that family? Can we call him that? I think so. That might be a I stretch. Do. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I am going to give the drink and our Ladies here, our audience members, are going to guess, you're going to ring your bell and guess uh, who chose this particular drink, okay? And I have to say, they do kind of go along with their personalities, yes. the drink with, and the men. Okay, so um, whoever rings the bell first, I will call on you, and if you get it wrong, the other person will have a chance to answer. If you get it right, you'll get a point. And whoever gets the most amount of points wins not only a copy of Alyssa's book, Two Good Around Superstars, but also a photo of Bradley Cooper, similar to the one that we have here on the set of Celebrity Corner, which everybody loves week in and week out, except for my husband. Okay, so the first drink, who requests on the 19th hole a cold beer? I think Ashley was first. Um, Michael Strahan. Wrong. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> brave, you're brave to answer first, but you were wrong. Do you want to give us a guess, Rose? I'm going to go with Michael Phelps. And the answer is? Michael Phelps. Michael Woo! Phelps. All right, all right. One, one, point, one point for Ashley. And what, what was Michael Phelps like? I, before, before you answer that question, I have to say, I, I don't want this to come off the wrong way, but I spent a night with Michael Phelps in a hotel room in New York City, not by myself. It was a party that I was invited to, and he was there. And I have to say that I had the privilege of, of hugging that big, hard, rock hard, sexy body of his. <laughs> it's, it's something I'm proud of. Yes, and, as it should be. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't hug him. <laughs> He's a great guy, he really is. You know, and right now he was, he's so in demand after you know, he had won and now he stopped and he's hot on golf. Yeah, yeah he's, he's, I like him a lot. I've run into him at the Soho House. Too. Oh, you have? Yeah, he's always, <laughs> he's always out and about in New York. Okay, next drink. Who goes for the Arnold Palmer with a splash of vodka, which is otherwise known as a John Daly? Ladies, oh, Rose? I'm gonna go with Bruce Jenner. Wrong. Really? <laughs> you need to deal with all those women. You need, to, you need it for all those women to deal with. <laughs> that is true. He does need a strong day. Okay, Ashley, do you want to give a shot? Um, Andy Roddick. You're both wrong. The oh, correct no. answer is? Michael Strahan. Michael Strahan. He goes for that drink. Now, did you interview him before or after he started hosting uh, Live with Kelly and I, it was, I think it was right before. Right before. Yeah, or he just started. And, and do you and think... And he didn't have, like, the popularity. I mean, he just... 
has really caught fire. I was skeptical when they said he would be, you know, her new co-host on the show. But I've been watching, and I think he does a really great job. He's relatable. He's kind of yeah. he's funny. He and I, I did know that from doing the interview and from having been around him a couple times. And his personality is just so vivacious that you're like, oh my gosh, he's. I think he does. Like you said, he relates to everybody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he. I think he was a good choice. Yeah. Okay. Next drink. This is an interesting one. All right. Who asks at the bar for Gatorade and popcorn? <laughs> Ashley. Andy Roddick. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to give a guess, Rose? I guess it's Bruce Jenner, right? It's Bruce, Bruce Jenner! Jenner. Yes. <laughs> he's, he's pretty quirky, so I wasn't too surprised by that. And you have an interesting story about Bruce. I do have a very interesting story about Bruce. He um, actually won a car, which is a very difficult thing to do in a charity outing. And he had told me this story when oh, we were doing- Oh, like he needs to win a car? I mean, <laughs> really? Exactly. I mean- But you know, it is for all golfers. It's a big time. You know, usually you have to get a hole in one or there's some type of contest and it's, it's very difficult. They make it difficult because right. you can't be given a car's way. So he told me this story when we were doing the interview and he said that he was so excited, he called Chris. And when he called her, he said, I'm fulfilling one of my all-time fantasies. She said, what are you talking about? What you, Bruce, what are you talking about? I, I couldn't make a joke right now, but I'm just gonna leave <laughs> it at that. Continue, <laughs> keep going. So he said, I'm fulfilling my, one of my all-time fantasies right now and calling by calling you and telling you I won a car in a golf tournament because you're always complaining that I play in these golf tournaments. And so finally he and won something. He, <laughs> he, finally, he, yeah, he, but he won big. He won a Mercedes. Oh. And she said, he said there was a pause, and she didn't say, wow, that's great, or congratulations. She said, what kind of car? <laughs> <laughs> so he said a Mercedes, uh, it was a Mercedes 350, and she said, well, I'd really like a Mercedes S550. Oh my goodness. So he said his free car cost him an additional 50 grand. To upgrade. To upgrade. So, to what she wanted. wanted. Oh. Why does that not surprise me? Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, I want to know what that conversation sounded like if, if when she asked what kind of car, he said a Honda. Like what, <laughs> what would have happened then? They would have been they would have been split up a lot sooner. But he said he put a I love golf a sticker on the dashboard of the car. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. Okay, last one, and this is process of elimination, but maybe you girls don't have good memories. I don't know. Who asked for the Bloody Mary? <laughs> Ashley? Andy Roddick. Andy Roddick! Yeah. Very good! <laughs> so so our final score is Ashley one and rows two, right? Did I keep track of this correctly? Yes, yes. yes. okay. <laughs> so Rose is our winner. Thank you girls so much for playing our very Thank first you. Celebrity Corner Game Show, Guess That Star. You did a really fabulous job, didn't they? Yes, it was great, good idea. And there are quite a few other uh, guys in your book that you've interviewed too, some pretty yep, famous 54. ones. Yep, 54, there's two women too. Oh, uh, I didn't know that. Yeah. The women uh, represent. Brandy Chastain, the soccer player. Okay. And uh, Bonnie Blair, the speed, or speed skater. Wow. So yeah, That's not great. a ton of women. Not a ton of women. We're trying oh. to get more of a man. We're right. bringing a man. Right, <laughs> of course. Well, you're like the, the the female representative in the golf community, uh, which I really like. I love like you know the back of your book. You, you're all sexy in a golf cart with a with a red dress on. I mean, that's the way to golf, right? That's how you golf. Well, anyway, uh, I also want to tell you that everyone in our studio audience is going home with uh, two good round superstars. So you can read this at home. Thank you so much. For, to Alyssa for joining us and to our fabulous studio audience members. Good job tonight, girls. Thank you. Coming up, traveling can be stressful if you don't have a private plane like Mariah Carey and Nick Cannon, but a few new apps and websites can make your next trip hassle-free. And how great would that be? Stay tuned. <laughs>